Grimsland. Grimsy Finds here. It's 7 a.m. in the morning. Uh, I'm going to be hitting up a couple community sales, but the only problem is that I'm, I only have a limited amount of money, so um, we'll see how it goes. Um, once I run out of money, I'm probably going to have to stop because um, you know I have bills and stuff. So um, anyways, uh, it kind of sucks, but uh, hopefully we find some finds with the money I do have. So anyways, guys, see you guys on the other side. Well, things I didn't tell you about, but uh, it's got three controllers. Okay. It's got like three different uh, ways of hooking it up to the TV. You can do it with a coaxial. I even have a gold-plated um, yeah, okay. Maybe these are the gold ones, the real nice ones. Mm. It's the small one. Okay. It's got the power cord is right, mm, right here. Oh, I see it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. And these are the games that I have with it. Some are PlayStation 1, some are 2. Oh, okay. back in there, yep. You and go. you get the carrying case. I'm make sure I don't have anything in here that you get in trouble. There you go. Mm -hmm. oh, cool. Does that come with it too? The little, that? The little oh yes, it's, it's okay. for a remote one. Okay. I don't have it, but okay. uh, but you're more than welcome to it. All right, thank you so much. Uh -huh, thank you. This GameCube line. I mean, it's it's pretty much basic. Um, your basic generic GameCube games. Uh, it was sixty, but it came with a, like. Well, there was like, uh, I want to say like, fifteen generic games. So that was pretty worth it. I think. Sure. And plus, I'm not selling that one. You're not what? Selling my Xbox One. Oh, okay. Well, of course not. Yeah, because it's brand new. Yeah, just sound like this. Why did I. Yeah, those are the ones I think I'm gonna. Okay. okay. You know how much you were asking per game? Or? Um. Well, Xbox games are a bit different to oh. NES games. This game's all $5 okay. for each because they're rare. Yeah. And then I will sell the. Hold up! I'm going to talk to you a little bit. Okay. Some of these games are very off in each other dip container. You know what? The system will be. No, I'm thinking of a price if I wanted to sell it. Because I I don't use it as much as the Atari. Mm -hmm. Do you know what the records are? Because the NES is real special, but... Because my dad got that for me, but... Oh. It's fine. Okay, so... By the way, all these games are checked in there. Oh, wait, you wanted Left 4 Dead 2? No, not that one. Okay. Left 4 Dead 1, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, these are, I'll give you them for, I was going to say 7, but I can change it on 10, just because they're old games. Some of these are really antique type of games, because this one's a really good antique. Because nobody ever plays it anymore, and it's kind of like one of those gem mm -hmm. type games. So I'll probably sell the NES for 25. Okay. And I'll probably buy the same. And then if you have kids too, I'll look at that too. You want me to get you these two? The, um, the what? The controllers? Yeah, because I, I kind of need the controllers. Because I'm probably right. going to give you this one for about a few more dollars okay. extra. I counted it, and it was about 70. Would you do 60? For the NES stuff? The NES, yeah, I'll do that. Uh, okay. That, that one looks like it's a fun game. Yeah, I, I love that one. It's a very good game. You can keep it. So I don't play yeah. it anymore. I can keep it.
keep it? Oh, oh yeah, you know what I'm saying. But how much? You said five bucks per game? I said five bucks. Yeah. I'll get the paper boy. Let me see how much more money I have. So there's 65 for the NES and the cards, and then three bucks for the paper boy. And it's still give you. Right here. And you guys just saw I bought this NES bundle. Oh my gosh, guys! Did not expect that when I went in. All, she, all they said was they had video games, and they, 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 you just don't know what they're gonna bring out with that. Got a couple 360 games in there too, and a couple Yu-Gi-Oh cards. So I'll see you guys in the pickup video. So in that cell right there, I don't know if you guys can see it. I got this uh, SNES bundle right here, and uh, I, I wasn't even gonna ask. I wasn't even gonna stop. It just looked like a couple furniture pieces and whatnot. So. They pulled this out. This is really great. I saw Robocop. I think there's a Robocop game in here. Yeah. Uh, Robocop versus Terminator has an $84.99 price tag. I don't think that's what it goes for anymore. But um, anyways, yeah, really, really happy to get this. Uh, 30 bucks. He just spit it out. He's like, uh, I have a Super Nintendo for 30 bucks. And I was like, okay, bring him out. Bring it out. And he did. So really, really happy with that. Um, so far, really good day today. Um, let's see what I can find. There's another community sale over here. So hopefully I... Uh, score anyways guys see you guys on the other side and that's all right there i just got uh this deck of ps1 games uh she said a dollar a piece so i said five bucks and she took it because there's only there's six of them so pretty good deal um really really happy with how it's going today um kind of unfortunate that i don't have the money to keep going uh but uh we'll see what happens anyways guys see you guys on the other side What's going on everyone? Grimsy Finds here and I have a pretty good uh, haul to show you guys. Um, went yard selling today. Um, really, really uh, tired actually. Um, just woke up actually. <laughs> so, But I decided to film it right now because I really don't have no time otherwise. So I'm going to go ahead and go through my pickups. Um, don't really know where to start so I'll probably just start up here. Um, and I do want to remind you guys to check out my Instagram because I post every time I find something I post it on there just to, um, as a preview to uh, the sale so uh, if you want to check that out go ahead it's uh, it's a link in the description below so anyways I think I'll start with this stack of PS1 games um, these were actually out already um, they were on the on the table I don't know I'm not sure if I got footage of this but uh, I was just like you know how much did you want for the PS1 games oh a dollar a piece so um, I got um, these for four dollars I think because I only had four dollars in my pocket Tony Hawk Skater 2 Tony Hawk's Pro Skater, uh, The Land of Four Time, Great Valley Racing Adventure 2, and Tiny Toon Adventures, Ruckies, or Pluckies, Big Adventure. So, not bad, I didn't have a lot of those, so I didn't mind doing that. Also, including that lot was uh, Twisted Metal. So, that makes it a good deal right there. Um, let's see what's next. Um, at a sale, um, they had, at one of the sales, they had these N64 games. Uh, they had Mario Kart, and they had, um, a couple other ones that were good, but he did not want to let them go. I tried, I tried doing my spiel, and it didn't work, so. Um, he said he wanted 50 cents for all three. I was like, you know what, I'll give you two bucks. And I gave him two bucks for it. Uh, Tony Hawk's Pro Skater. Ahem, I didn't have this one, so pretty glad I get this one. And Madden 64. And again, I paid, uh, and again, I paid, uh, Two bucks so i'm not really losing anything there um at another sale they had um they didn't i said they had video games they didn't but these were out uh anime dvds and a manga so i decided to pick it up uh, she said 10 bucks i thought it was a little high but i paid it because she wasn't going down so uh and you watch the secret of the past the movie a uh, secret of the moon another movie and then the three manga uh the number 12 number 14 and number 13 so pretty pretty nice uh, i really rarely see uh, anime or manga at sale so i picked it up speaking of anime and manga i got these two for five a piece uh so it was 10 together uh the complete digital Remastered master season four and the digital Remastered master season three and i love the, the frieza arc so i'm um, really really happy to get that if i can get them cheap like this uh, i will definitely pick them up but quickly i regretted buying this immediately after i did a ps1 or ps2 bundle there's a bunch of games in the cd case really nothing special there's parasite eve but the, all these are really scratched cheap reader i mean there's not there's not there's this i regretted buying this immediately after i did um he said 20 bucks uh came with this pelican receiver 
the uh, it came with three controllers: a regular PS2 one, a regular PS1 one, and a Pelican wired controller. So kind of interested in to see where the other one was, but and then it came with a PS2. It's really scratchy. He assured me it worked. I don't know if I believe him. <laughs> And it came in with the bonus game, uh, Nuclear Strike. So, um, I really hope it works. Um, 20 bucks is a little high. I shouldn't have bought it. I, we all done that where we regret buying something. I've done it a couple of times actually, so um, kind of need to stop doing that. But you know, when I sit, when I'm doing bad, I don't find anything. That's what I end up doing. So, um, anyways, that was that. Chester bought me a bag full of Pokemon cards. I'm not gonna go through all of them. I'm just gonna show you real quick. Um, basically, they were they each were priced on like this one has four. Basically, he offered her 20 bucks for the whole bundle, and she took it. So I was just like, okay, I'll, I'll see what I can do with them. So yeah, see the five bucks on that one, and it's just this whole bag full of cards. So um, I don't know. I don't really know the value of Pokemon cards. I know the one old ones because I, I still have my old ones, but I don't know the value of the uh, newer ones. So who knows? Bought this stack of PS3 games. Uh, he had two dollars each on on all of these, so I decided to pick them up. Call of Duty: Modern Warfare 3, Hayes, Resident Evil 5. I don't think I had this one. Disney's Universe. So like the Hedgehog, I know I didn't have this one. And then the Need for Speed Hopper suit, and there's the two dollars each. And then, oh yeah, and, the, and all this was pretty much in a community sale that was local to my house. I was really really excited to find video games. Uh, Def Jam Fight for New York, Blinks Two, Master of Time and Space, Gears of War, Ballers, and then the Star Wars Clone Wars and Tetris World. Um, she said make me an offer because she just wanted to get rid of them. I said five bucks. She said it's your lucky day. I'm like not really, but okay. <laughs> so yeah, that was that was pretty cool. Um, let me get, show this GameCube one first. Um, I was in the sale. Um, she said she had GameCube games. I uh, came out. It actually came in at 360 box. Um, I, asked, I I was, I don't know why she did that, but uh, the GameCube is in okay shape. Came with one controller. The controller seems in, like it's in really good shape. Um, oh great, the door gets stuck. Yeah, the GameCube. And stack full of games. She wanted 80 for the bundle. I was like, no, I can't do that. <laughs> um, and then she kept saying 50 for the what I wanted, and I was just like. You know the best I could do is 40. Um, I'm gonna and I just I'm, I was about to leave and she's like, okay, fine, I'll do 40. So um, and she's like, she called these the good games. Really, there wasn't really anything good. Only two good games are Dragon Ball Z Budokai and then uh, Yu-Gi-Oh the the Kingdom. Those are the only two uh, good games. Spider-Man, Star Wars, The Clone Wars. Uh, King Kong. Yeah, these are the good games. Uh, Simpsons Hit and Run. This one was okay. I didn't have this one. It's Time Splitters 2 and Scooby Doo. So all that was 40 bucks. Again, I immediately almost regretted it buying it, but hey, it's a GameCube, so can't really complain there. So the last score was the best score. It was actually my first score. Um, I, I after I bought I got this pickup, I pretty much wanted to just stop because <laughs> it was early and I was tired, but I kept going. Um, but yeah, this this first sale was amazing. Um, really, really happy to get it. Um, she just said she had video games, and I'm like, uh, what do you have? She's like, I'm not sure. My son is nosy, and uh, the son came out. It didn't have anything on him, and I was like, oh, where do you have any video games? Like, yeah, I have an NES and a Xbox 360 and a PS2, and I was like, oh, okay. Um, and he was like, you know, you want to come inside? I'm like, sure. Because there, uh, the yard sale was actually really busy, you know, and bringing them outside would have probably been a bad idea because someone else would have been like, oh, hovering over me. So uh, it was glad, I was glad I was, they invited me inside and I got to look at the games inside and it was really, really nice. So um, first off, I'm going to show you the two controllers it came with. The two uh, um, 
light guns. And then came came with four original. Sorry, I keep messing this up. I keep forgetting how many controllers there were. It's ridiculous. Four controllers. And then and then it came with the original um, NES Advantage. That's pretty cool. So that's a, if you count that as a controller, that's number five. And then the um, NES Max. So that's a six. Six controllers is ridiculous. Came with uh, the NES itself. Didn't check if there's a bonus game. No, there's no bonus game. But uh, really, really cool NES. It looks clean. He assured me it worked. He said he had to fiddle with it a little bit. Um, let's see. Also came with two manuals: uh, the Karate Kid and Mario Bros. Duck Hunt. That was pretty neat. Uh, before I show you the NES games, I'm going to show you the uh, 360 games I bought. Men in Black, Men in Black, uh, Alien Crisis, Storm Rays, Rise. Wanted that one. Uh, he said that actually that one has still has online support. Left 4 Dead and Halo 3. First he said five bucks each. Then he's like, you know what? I'll give you a deal. Um, and I'll tell you what I paid at the end. I uh, got these Yu-Gi-Oh cards, Seven Tools of the Bandit. He had Yu-Gi-Oh cards, and I was just like, okay, can I look at them? And then I picked these ones. Heavy Storm, uh, Magic Jammer, Solemn Judgment, and these are all the old ones. They're a little, they're a little wear, an Upstar Goblin. I think this goes for like 14, I can't remember. So, um, pick those up, uh, Recoupers, definitely. Um, and I'm going to probably keep that Solemn Judgment, because I collect them too. Um, and then, the end, let me show you the NES games now. Like I said, it's already ridiculous. I ended up paying, I think, 60, 60 or 80, I can't remember, around, somewhere around there. Um, it was a really, really good deal, though, um, especially with all those controllers. So, let's see, uh, no particular order. Let's see, Rad Racer, Mario Bros. and Duck Hunt, uh, Paperboy, uh, let's see, uh, Millipede in this case, Wild Gunman, which is really cool. 1942. Really nice shooter. Jaws. Mario Bros. and Duck Hunt. Bump and Jump. Uh, TNC Surf Design. Uh, Dr. Mario. Uh, Mario Bros. Super Mario Bros. 2. Burger Time. The Karate Kid, I didn't have a lot of these, so I was really happy. And then Contra, really clean copy too. Really, really happy to get this. So, like I said, that 80, 60 bucks, 80 bucks wasn't bad at all. I was really, really happy. It made the day for me. Um, oh yeah, I forgot about this one. This is the last pickup right here. Um, this one, I was just kind of cruising around my area. Um, didn't really expect to find anything. Uh, went to the sale. There was uh, two two parents. Like, oh, I was waiting for my son to come home and see if he has. He, he actually just got home when I was asking. Um, I asked him, he's like, oh, no, I have an Xbox One. I'm selling it, blah, 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 blah. And I was like, oh, no, you know, I'm looking for older. He's like, oh, my, I think my dad has a Super Nintendo. And I was like, really? I just asked him. So I asked his dad again. I was like, oh, yeah, I have a Super Nintendo. I'll give you 30 bucks for it. He, didn't, he hadn't even brought it out. I was like, okay, I'll let me look at it first. And I'll let you know. He brought it out. I uh, came, uh, came with two controllers, which is already a bonus. Two official Super Nintendo controllers. Let me show you the system. Here's the system. Pretty clean, actually. A little bit yellowed. Not gonna die. And then the the games was okay. there wasn't anything special, but um, some games I don't have, so really happy to get those. Um, let's see. Uh, Top Gear two. Uh, Major League Baseball. Big Hurt. Top Gear number one, so I don't have both of those. I'm gonna keep both of those. Um, Street Fighter two, and the best one for me was uh, RoboCop and Terminator. I know it's not rare, but didn't have it, so really happy to get that. Um, can't beat that that deal for thirty bucks. You can easily make that money back and keep the games I want to keep. So um, really, really happy to do that. Uh, found an NES and a Super Nintendo, so I really can't complain. Um, really, really happy to do that. I left my number to like sixteen people. It was ridiculous. So. I was excited the whole day, so um, really, really happy. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the pickup. Um, remember to check my Instagram for uh, updates on garage sales. Like I, I try to update it every Saturday with what I picked up. Um, 
but yeah, I'm really, really excited to see to see some video games that I'm doing pretty well. I actually didn't expect to find any NES, any NES games that I needed because usually it's like just Mario Duck Hunt and you know Mario Bros. So really, really happy to actually get stuff I need. And anime was always a plus, so really, really happy to do that. Um, so, anyways, guys, that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching. Grimsy finds out.